Okay, so in this video, we're just going to have a quick look at how we use frames in TK Enter to organize our content. So uh, right now, we just have a basic program running where a label appears on the left-hand side. But what we're going to do is we're going to set up so there might be, say, two columns. So just to give you an idea of how that might work, uh, firstly, I'll just remove the label. Now, um, we need to create each frame as a, uh, as an object. So I'm just going to call my first one a left frame and that's going to be an instance of the frame class and it's going to sit in the root area. So remember that's the first thing we do is we need to say where it's going to be located and if you've been following these videos you realize that root is what we called our uh, root window. Now we need to pack that into place so we're going to say left frame dot pack but we need to position it so to the left so we're going to say side equals left and we'll do the same with our right frame so we'll set it up as a, a frame and it's going to be sitting inside the root window and then we are going to pack that in and this time we're going to um, put it on the right hand side okay so we've got our two frames all set up so now when we um, decide that we're going to say put some content in, like a label, um, and I'll just put, um, I don't know, really great lab naming conventions here, like label1, uh, that's going to be an instance of label, and this time when we decide where we want to be located, I'm going to say, well, I want it to be in the left frame, and then I'll put my text in there, so uh, I'll call this one left column, and then we'll pack that in. And I'll do the same with label two. I'll actually I'll put that in the right frame. So we've got a nice heading here. And again, we will need to pack that in. So what we should have now, all going well, is two frames. One's on the left, one's on the right. And then we have our labels that have been placed into each of those frames. And you can see there we go. Now it's a bit like um, floating in HTML when you've got our left and right div tags. So in this case, we're going to use frames. So that's pretty much how we can pack them. We can, if we wanted to, we could put them top and bottom. And then that way, when we run it, they would end up like that. So you can position them however you want. But I'm just going to go back to left and right. So again, what we've done here is we have set up two frames and you can't really see them, but they are like a left hand column and a right hand column and then we can go ahead and put content into them. Um, and just to give you one, I guess one more example, if I put in um, label three in here, if I put that into the left frame as well, and then I'll just put this, let's call it com content or something, some such. When I pack this in, it should go into the left frame and it will sit underneath the previous label. So there we go. You can see those two labels, label one and label three, are sitting in my left frame and my right column heading is sitting in my right frame.